Hi, for question number two from October 2010, A-level maths HSC P3, the parametric equations of a curve are x is equal to t over 2t plus 3, y is equal to e to the power of minus 2t, and we need to find the gradient of the curve at the point for which t is equal to 0. Okay, so here we are. Now, first of all, we're going to differentiate the parametric equations. All right, so differentiate x, and here's the uh, two functions and its division, so therefore we're going to be using quotient rule. All right, so we're going to say u is equal to t, and v is equal to 2t plus 3. And so we have du over dt is equal to 1, and dv over dt is equal to 2. So v du by v dt, v du by dt minus u dv by dt over v square, and that is kosher rule. I'm sure you're very familiar with this. So therefore, we're going to say dx over dt is equal to v du. So 1 times this is the same, 1, 2t plus 3, minus 2 times t, which is 2t, all divided by v square, so 2t plus 3 to the square. So these ones going to cancel out, and we're going to be left with 3 over 2t plus 3 to the square. So this is dx over dt. Now similarly, we're going to be differentiating this one. So we have y is equal to this exponential fraction. Therefore, dy by dt is going to be minus 2e to the minus 2t. So what is dy by dx? Therefore, dy by dx is equal to dy by dt times dt by dx. So this is what is going to give us the answer. Therefore, so let's do dy by dx. So dy by dx is equal to dy by dt, and dy by dt is um, here, minus 2e to the minus 2t, minus 2e to the minus 2t times dt over dx. We have dx over dt, therefore dt over dx is going to be the inverse of that. So we're going to put uh, 2t plus 3 to the square on top, and this one goes at the bottom. So, in other words, we're saying minus 2 times the whole thing is minus 2 times 2t plus 3 to the square, divided by 3 to the e to the 2t. So this comes down here, the law of indices. I'm sure you should be on top of it right now. Okay, so this is dy by dx. Now, what happens when t is equal to 0? So we just need to substitute t in here and find the... This is actually the gradient. So therefore, I'm going to say that dy by dx is equal to minus 2 times... Uh, 2 times t, 2 times t is 0. So 2 times 0 is 0. 0 plus 3 is 3, so we have 3 to the square, all divided by 3 times e to the power of 2t. t is 0, so e to the power of 0. And I'm going to be left with minus 2 times 9 over 3, because this is 1, 1 times 3 is 3. So 3 goes in 3, 1, 3 goes in 9 is 3, and that's going to be minus 6. Therefore, here we, here we are for the gradient uh, for which t is equal to 0.